taken two cups of rice flour and half a cup of urad dal or black gram flour now you may make this with any combination of ingredients like you can take two cups of rice and half cup of besan or heat it up in this karai three tablespoons of oil we need to put very hot oil into the batter and in the spices we need one and a half teaspoon of salt one teaspoon of cumin seeds half a teaspoon of ajwain or caraway seeds one teaspoon of red chili powder and one tablespoon of sesame seeds For making the chaklis, we need a chakli maker. There are two types available in the market. One is of this kind, and the other is the gun type. It has got a star attachment at the bottom, like this one. And there's always a manual. You can always read it and follow the instructions. I'm going to add the urad flour to the rice flour, and I'm also going to add all the dry spices. Then we are going to mix it. Now I'm going to add the hot oil. and we'll just wait for some while till it cools down then we can start kneading by adding very little water at a time and we have to knead it just like we knead a normal chapati dough made this dough it's quite soft just like the chapati dough and i added a tablespoon of oil because now we're going to massage it and make it very smooth the dough is all nice and smooth as you can see and i have taken a big bowl of the same dough and now i'm going to cover this dough because the rice flour tends to get very hard and it forms a layer on the dough which we do not want now i've taken a plastic sheet you may even take a wax paper and uh, we can roll our uh, chaklis out onto this plastic sheet because then it becomes very easy to lift it and even to mold it so right now i'm just molding my dough into a cylindrical shape and placing it into this chakli maker and we're just going to press it and form the chaklis as we press the chakli comes down so we are just going to enclose one end and then go across around that end and form circles so these circles we have to make according to our choice maybe two or three layers and as many as you want so we are just going to break it and then you can seal it now i'll show you one more in the same manner we're just going to press it and when it comes down we are just going to enclose one end and then keep going around the other way is i have the string over here so i will just fold it around like this so if you are a beginner you can always try this you can have small chaklis or big chaklis so likewise we'll make of all the So we made a batch of few chaklis over here, and now we will start frying them. I've placed them on this wax paper, so it becomes very easy to lift it. Oil is heated, but I've kept the flame at medium, and now very carefully we're going to place the chaklis. Fry them only at medium flame because you do not want them to be golden from the outside, but very soft from the inside. We want it to be crispy, so keep the flame at medium. chaklis are nice and golden so now we will start removing them and we have to be very patient while frying them and one sign that our chaklis are ready is that uh, the oil stops bubbling like very few bubbles are there so that means the chaklis so are ready friends here our chakli is ready and it has given us about 33 chaklis the batter that we made so i'll break one and show you very crispy So guys do give it a try post your comments share my videos with your family and friends and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching bye bye. my video